I think the idea is fantastic. I don't just think it's good, I think it's fantastic. I think it has a huge potential, and that's why I disagree with what they're saying. I believe you truly do need the money. Yeah. So, are you going to get £100,000? This is the question. I'm into the idea. The return, for me, the only way I can assimilate it is that it's like putting that £100,000 into a paper water bucket. I think my money would go very, very quickly out. And Why I don't see the that? fact that I could get a return on the money, and that's the only reason why I'm out. And he's almost out of options, and out of the den. But he's got one last chance. Can he persuade James Kahn to increase his offer and invest the whole £100,000? Mm, like putting your money into a paper bucket. What a turn of phrase, Peter. <laughs> I couldn't think of anything else to say, actually, but it was, it was interesting. I mean, you've said Justin Timberlake, but... When, I, when he came oh, in, the David Beckham, the David like, yeah. Beckham, he, they were incredible, honestly. I mean, I couldn't believe it. And Jack Sparrow, he had all the movements of Jack Sparrow. So he had all the mannerisms he off to a T. But, but you said no, because... Well, I just couldn't see that. I thought, actually, if you want somebody like that, you go and hire them. Yeah. So how do you actually make that into a real business? I couldn't, couldn't quite get there. Hmm. An agency, I guess. I mean, that's what they were asking for. Yeah, and they actually form an agency, so they all work together. And you hire them out at £250 a year, £300, whatever and you pay this sort of subscription fee, but I can't see that really taking off. OK, I well, let's, let's not concentrate on them. New yeah. series is back. Are you, are you excited, Peter? Chance for you to make some more money? Well, do you know what? I am excited. I think Series 5, it, it probably is the best series yet. I mean, you know, I'm, I'm always going to be honest. I think it is. Um, I think the producers have gone a little bit over the top this year. I criticised them last year because they brought us quite a few wackos. Yeah. Um, but I think this year we needed people in white coats outside because <laughs> we've had some seriously crazy Come people. Come on, then, give us a few. Well, we've had, from, from people that came in and actually had, he had a little... Um, Thing that you play table tennis with, a table tennis ball, ping, ping oh, pong ball. Ping pong. Yeah. Well, that was the next great thing to train children how to pee into the toilet. So he threw the ping pong ball in the toilet and he said, you aim for it. Um, and he wanted money for it. And that. he wanted, I think, about £75,000 for it, <laughs> um, which was interesting because he put a little pretty picture on it um, with, a, with a pen. Um, and we, but there's just been, I mean, there's so many. Um, we've had uh, a couple of sort of, we had a Mohican somebody with a very strange Mohican, selling beef jerky. Um, and he felt that his appearance was really quite something, quite and that part was of be. his so whole... So what is James Khan? Kind of... He's the new dragon. What does he make of all of this? Well, is James is an up? interesting one. And I think I don't want to spoil it for, for, yeah. for the fellow viewers. And I'll tell you why. is because I don't think I've quite met anybody um, in my history of working in business that has quite the same investment strategy as James. Um, he has a, quite a unique... Sort of way about him. Well, let's put it that well, way. well put, but that's part of the beauty of dragons, then, isn't it? The way you dragons. I mean, you worked together initially. If it really is wacky, and you say, you know, get out of it. Your comments are interesting, but it's the way I see you trying to bluff each other, trying to really. You, I can see you thinking, oh, maybe this is quite a good idea. Trying to put some some of your fellow dragons off so you can get more of the gravy. Yeah, I think uh, you're spot on. I mean, uh, it's a, it's a shame, really. You don't really get to see the sort of real behind the scenes. Um, to say that we're competitive is an understatement. You know, literally, we are, we're walking off set sometimes and we don't get a deal and we're actually not talking to each other for a couple of hours. Um, so there's a lot of goings on. And I think behind the scenes it will be great and you might actually get to see that some of it on the That would be good. I think we'd That's like that. Idea.